Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars. And the scumbag uh, Mark Zuckerberg, who is a dedicated leftist, how I don't understand how this guy got to be a multi-billionaire, yet he's a dedicated leftist. It just boggles my mind. What he wants, to, what he's, he's going to do, essentially, is rank news organizations according trustworthiness, which in his case means that uh, the further left they are, the more trustworthy they are. That's the way this works. Okay, Facebook's CEO Mark Zuckerberg said Tuesday the company has already begun to implement a system that ranks news organizations based on trust worthiness and promotes or suppresses its content based on that metric. Now a lot of people like to say this is a private company. No, it's not. It's uh, on the public stock market. These leftists have worked their way in and working the uh, system. Zuckerberg said the company has gathered data on how consumers per perceive news brands by asking them to identify whether they've heard of various public publications like the uh, Communist Manifesto or if they trust them. We put that data in the system and it's acting as a boost or suppression and we're going to dial up the intensity of that over time, he said. Mr. Zuckerberg, uh, why don't you just put the Communist Manifesto at the top, because that's what you believe. I don't know how you got to be a billionaire. This, I, I have no idea with you. We feel like we have a responsibility to further break down polarization and find common ground. Which means leftists get to say what they want. Conservatives, shut up. Zuckerberg met with a new group of news media executives at the Rosewood Sand Ho Hill Hotel in Menlo Park after delivering his keynote speech at Facebook's annual F8 Developer Con Conference Tuesday. The meeting included rep representatives from BuzzFeed News, The Information, Quartz, New York Times, Hardcore Communist, uh, CNN, Hardcore Communist, Wall Street Journal, Hardcore Communist, NBC, Hardcore Communist, Recode, Univision, uh, Communist, that's uh, Spanish language. I'm a little surprised that Barron's, Daily Beast, The Economist, Huffington Post, Inside there, the Atlantic, and New York Post. I'm more than a little surprised that New York Post would have anything to do with this. Uh, you people in the news business, if you're a uh, right wing conservative, I would shun this moron like uh, nothing else. The event called OTR, short for Off the Records, an annual gathering meant for new. Media news executives talk shop. In the second year, Zuckerberg remarks were initially meant to be like the name of the conference off the record, but he agreed to answer questions on the record. Zuckerberg said the company will invest billions of dollars in a combination of artificial intelligence and tens of thousands of human moderators to keep both fake news and deliberate propaganda at bay, especially in, in elections. So you're only going to have one perspective, the left perspective. That's what he's saying. We're essentially going to be losing money on doing political ads, he said, of the investment the company is making to avoid repeat of the spread of Russian propaganda in 2016 U.S. election. That is a lie. You are a liar, 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 pants on fire. Mr. Zuckerberg, I'm going to say this once. Get this through your head. 
Trump got elected by people. I'll, I'll be honest with you, mostly uh, blue collar working folks were fed up with the system. It wasn't due to Russian anything. Russians had nothing to do with this. You're crazy. Mr. Zuckerberg, please check yourself in. Big miss is that we don't expect these kind of coordinated information operations in 2016. We didn't expect, excuse me, says Zuckerberg, and that the company is more focused on hacking and ma malware. He said the company is expecting that kind of information more now as already successfully countered it in elections from France to Alabama. So, he's just going to make sure that the only ones that get elected are communists. Unbelievable. Mr. Zuckerberg, sir, you are a self-made billionaire, and yet you're a communist. I don't understand this. Somebody out there able to explain this to me? Very serious. Uh... We're in trouble, folks. We're in big trouble. Trump's only one person. I'm Artifacts of Mars, and I don't want to go long on any one of these stories. Thanks for watching.